POPULAR FORT WORTH DISTRICT COULD SOON SEE A BOOST IN BUSINESS JUST IN TIME FOR THE HOLIDAYS. TONIGHT CITY COUNCIL APPROVED A NEW RATE STRUCTURE FOR THE PARKING METERS, SPECIFICALLY IN THE WEST 7TH URBAN VILLAGE. OUR CAROLINE VANDERGRIFF IS LIVE TONIGHT IN FORT WORTH, WHICH HAS uh, BECOME KIND OF A HOTLY CONTESTED DEBATE THIS HAS. That's right. This has been an issue going on for months, Doug. But shops and restaurants here hope this change will encourage more people to come to this area because they can now park for free for two hours during the day. Businesses say that these parking meters here have really been hurting their bottom line. I think it's very confusing right now and people just get frustrated and so they go to areas that they know. Parking problems have plagued West 7th Urban Village for months. We're inundated now with parking meters out that nobody can work, everybody complains about it. Street spots used to be free until the city installed parking meters in August of last year. The owner of Pop Safari Cigars and Fine Wines says the move initially caused his daytime business to drop by 30%. He says people don't want to pay to park or risk a ticket just to run in and buy something. So you're getting punished for coming down here to shop. After hearing from several frustrated business owners, the city of Fort Worth proposed a compromise. People can park in metered spots for free for two hours between 10 a.m. and 5 p.m. The rate goes up to three dollars for the third hour and beyond. That sounds great. I mean, I don't. I don't know why it's not a thing already. This is the time people are doing holiday parties and the season's approaching and everybody wants to be out. They're buying gifts, so it could only help everybody here. City Council unanimously approved the new rate structure tonight. It goes into effect this Friday. Live in Fort Worth, I'm Caroline Vandergriff, CBS 11 News. Carol